I was like, what? What? <laughs> Love yours. No such thing. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. Love yours. No such thing as a life that's better than yours. No such thing. No such thing. Heart beating fast. Let a nigga know that he alive. Fake niggas, mad snakes, snakes in the grass. Let a nigga know that he arrived. Sleeping on your level, cause it's beauty in the struggle, nigga. It's beauty in the struggle, nigga. Yeah. It's beauty in the struggle, ugliness in the success. Hear my words and listen to my signal of distress. I grew up in the city and know sometimes we had less. Compared to some of my niggas down the block, man, we were blessed. And life can't be no fairy tale, no once upon a time. But I be goddamn if a nigga don't be trying So tell me mama please why you be drinking all the time Cause all the pain he brought you still linger in your mind Cause pain still lingers on mine On the road to riches, listen, this is what you find The good news is, nigga, you came a long way The bad news is, nigga, you went the wrong way The green is better, life that's better than yours No such thing as a life that's better than yours freak and a friend too, yeah You into everything I'm into Ho, I got something that I can lend you. Ho, a peace of mind, baby. Come and get a peace of mind. Yeah. Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait, your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's the feeling that I get when we lock lips. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I f your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring your easel and pencils too. Here you go, you try to tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said I'm trying to keep it tight for my new freak and a friend too. Yeah, you into everything I'm into. Ho, I got something that I can lend you. Ho, a peace of mind, baby. Come and get a peace of mind. Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait, your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yep. So, guys, I'm actually done packing. I packed everything into that one box, and then I put some of the things, you know, here, and also some here yeah, that I'll be going home with. And those are a little bit of groceries that I just put there in case I'll need something from there in this couple of days. In this two days, I can say, you know. So this is actually, I'm just going to be carrying this bag, this big bag, and this bag, and then, um, my Mr. Price bag. Yeah, because it has my shoes in it. And then I'll have to wash those shoes there for this. Like, my cupboard is literally empty. And then, I'll take these off, those off, and those off once I'm going, on the day I'm going, because I feel like I don't want my room to be so empty so i'll also take these pictures off of course and put them in that box like this pictures that lamp and all those coats and everything put them in that box and also this lead cable take along that plug so this is how i've decluttered and how it's looking for now the space is literally just empty that is just butter because i'll be needing butter some cooking oil my vape guys i don't know i mean i know that you guys saw this in my story or if you're my friends on close friends or whatsapp whatever my vape actually broke but i don't know if you guys can see that properly yeah but it actually broke this tank actually broke it's this i blame these loft rooms because this is the second time my first phone fell from here i know it feels weird talking facing this side but my first phone fell off here and then it broke my six glass and then there was so much ink in it and now and now they have found ways to attack my vape how 
but this is just gonna be i thought like i'm gonna have to replace the whole way but actually i just have to replace the tank which is 80 dollars this glass tank which is okay my flavor is actually still a lot and we've come to the middle of the month so uh, yeah so and then this is basically i obviously need my bible my lock my cards and then there's just a book that i'll need to um study from for my last module and there's a basically just my timetable and some of my stationaries that i'll need to i pack that up of course and then now these are the clothes that i took up not everything but these are basically just like you guys look at my bed like i know you guys are feeling like i got a period white sheets <laughs> but yeah so these are basically just um what is this are my clothes are, but are they are just actually the t-shirts because they got dry at first so i took them off i'm actually gonna iron them later if i have the energy but we'll see i'll vlog with doing that i'm just waiting for my hair hey my barber guys i'm so tired oh honestly i'm so tired i'm just waiting for my barber to actually get here then i'll speak to you guys probably okay so no i'll speak to you once my barber is here you kidding but yeah yeah so i'm basically just done i got my hair cut yes i did get my hair cut and yeah i'm basically just done bathing and well seated i'm really done with everything i have decluttered everything almost packed away everything that i won't be needing in the next two days um and also my box is literally standing here my like my knees are in onto my box right now so i actually realized that i did not do an intro how dare i like how dare i but hi guys hi dazzlers hi dazzlers i should stop saying guys i should stop saying guys hi dazzlers welcome back to yet another video hi if you're new here this is glitches entertainment and there's an avenue with dazzle i'm just glitches and if you're a returning subscriber baby thank you so much for coming back um i hope you guys stay i hope you guys i hope you dazzlers stay i hope my dazzlers stay and yeah this is gonna be a travel vlog so of course i started filming where i'm like packing up decluttering and everything so i'm actually not gonna be vlogging consistently as i do my youtube youtube you know i'm gonna be going to town but i think i don't think i'm really gonna be vlogging vlogging like i'm here in town this and that if i do yeah i did just to add on to the context of the video to make it a little bit longer because i don't want this video to be shorter than 30 minutes i'm praying that it's not shorter than 30 minutes because i'll literally cry i'll tear up i'm i'm just into longer vlogs like you know i mean longer videos even if it's just still on videos i just want them to be exceeding 30 minutes like if it's under 30 minutes i just feel disrespect i don't want to see that too cool something i want to see 30 minutes above but if it's a vlog i want to see it 40 minutes but now i want to see like 50 minutes above you know but yeah anyways this is gonna be a travel vlog i'm traveling back home on wednesday yes i'm traveling back home on wednesday and yeah super 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 excited i just finished watching all these vlog guys and everything that i say i'm like am i saying that i think am i not saying that i think i don't know if you guys watch it but if you guys didn't watch it yes the video that i'm talking about um the things that the youtube things that she was saying that you should know what what she was like you know you should do this and this and that and then it's literally it's caught up in my membrane like literally caught up in my medulla so everything that i'm saying is like golly am i supposed to say this golly am i not supposed to say this but we do we you know yeah um what else yeah so basically i'm writing my exam on wednesday i'm writing two papers actually we'll be writing the ghetto and yeah i'm actually going back on that wednesday as well hopefully hopefully so yeah i don't know when i'll see you guys i'll probably i'll probably only see you guys on wednesday probably I guys i'm <coughs> dazzlers hi dazzlers i'm literally so sorry i forgot to introduce this vlog for today today is monday and i'm off the town as i said I wouldn't be vlogging but i said i wanted context you know so i want to add this part of the video so i'm basically just going to town going to run a few errands looking gorge but i feel like the light would have made so much sense like i would have been looking more glowier in the lights for angela you know but yeah i'm on my way to town 
and we'll talk there. I'm actually not even gonna vlog the road me because at this point me, we don't need funny funny things for now. <laughs> I guess, guys. The thing is that Goli has haunted me. Goli was like, ah, there's no need to film the road. This, that, that. Like, if you love me, if you love those montages of the road, please put it down in the comment section and tell me. But for now, I won't be vlogging the road because you guys have seen this road million times to vinyl. It's literally in all of my vlogs. Trust me. If it's not in my set down videos, it's in all the other vlogs, you know. So you guys have literally seen it a bazillion dozen times, you know. So I'm basically just wearing a vest. Destiny was like halting me for this, not doing the full outfit check, but I'm just wearing my vest. I'm wearing my black bag and I'm wearing black sweatpants. There's shades and there's cute earrings that have a little cross on it yeah like destiny has been haunting me for not doing trip check but i don't know if you guys can see me properly but i hope you do even if you guys don't i'll make sure that i edit it to make it a little bit brighter but yeah yeah anyways once but no shut hi guys and welcome to yet another vlog no it's not another vlog it's just the same travel vlog you know, so today is basically Friday and um, I'm finished, I finished. No, it's not Friday, it's Thursday. Yo, but it's, it low-key feels like a Friday. But I'm actually finished writing. I have success, it is, it is safe to say I've successfully completed my first year. Like it's literally so safe to say, you know. So I'm done, I'm done packing. I'm going back home, so I'm gonna show you guys what I've gathered along. And also I know the last part of this video, it's where I'm like on my way to go to, go run my errands. But I had such an unsuccessful errand day and ever since then I just came back I was feeling all low I'm also I was feeling low today but then I was also like I should vlog like I should definitely vlog I didn't forget to vlog but I was like I should definitely vlog but that day I, it was just such an unsuccessful errand one day you know so uh, it was a lot it took a lot like literally I forgot that I'm existing till that point so yeah I'm basically done packing 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 let me show you guys what I packed you know yeah so i'm basically just wearing this cap i know you saw this look in the other vlog it's just this look i feel like it's just a shirt yeah and the cap you can see this cap everywhere so yeah i'm wearing my nike cap i'm wearing the shirt my earrings guys i love this earrings so much like just look at them with the crosses there i love them so much like you know i love silver when it glitters because silver is already like a plain it's giving like plain sort of vibes and if it doesn't glitter it's more worse you know so yeah i'm actually just looking at people you know like almost on stories a kid a kid a kidnet a kidnet so let me show you guys that yeah so i'm wearing the shirt and i'm i'm wearing this jeans this belt and my shoes yeah so let me show you guys what i packed mm. so this is officially the final stuff this is actually my bag my laptop bag but it it's now some it, like, so many things inside it so it's no more laptop bag it's a lot of hole a lot of things a lot of bag my pillow my blanket this i just put my shoes there some of my clothes are here my clothes are here i'm gonna be carrying this water bottle in front um this is just another bag because i don't have an extra bag to like pack my things in my suitcase and then my box my other box is standing here. i still have to take it for storage to storage and then i'm just listening to sp uh, music but i'll pack that yeah i made ample space and then i'm gonna be carrying my bag Put my Vaseline there and yeah, that's basically it. Like guys, I'm gone. I am gone. I'm gone. Gone, 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 gone. So, um, disclaimer also is that I don't think I'll be traveling. Maybe I might not be traveling while it's light like this because it's like 5 a 5 p.m. right now. And the time that we are like out of Ventuk, like that time it would, have been, it would have been like night. So I won't be able to like vlog for you like the road and that and that and that but definitely definitely once i'm home i promise you guys this definitely once i'm back home i will speak to you guys even within the evening i'll speak to you guys and tell you guys what time i got back home and i pray that the car really comes today so that I, i'm able to go back to eight like eight well i really want to go sleep under my mom's my parents roof today two k two night for Angela. so yeah it's been a great year it's really been a great year ah this year was not great i'm kidding this year was not great this year through through stones but yeah other than that we coped we survived here we are bigger it's 
small girl, big god, big girl, bigger god. So Sanjula, ah. uh, so yeah, this is it. I'm out. I'll see you guys in Ventuk probably next year again. Okay? <laughs> we'll see Ventuk again next year. For now, I'm just gonna give you guys back to 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 content that you guys have definitely been waiting for that i've been sleeping on you guys for this now you guys thought like this was me being invented giving content mm -mm. Mm -mm. it was not even close it was like 20 percent. i'm giving you guys the full onset vlog blockbuster content i'm giving you two hour vlogs you really really show scariest entertainment two hour vlogs let's go kidding why is it it's always like when i was going to write but anyways guys i'll speak to you guys once i'm back home or once i get the chance to speak to you guys then sharp Take a step out, get some in now, let's all edge out To some ice book, you'll be heavy in my mind Can you get the heck out? I mean grass now, drop me bum though You so you so you baby 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 Hi guys, I haven't spoken to you ever since I got back. Oh my selection like that. Mm. The lighting is ghetto it's giving ghetto yeah but i got back today is saturday i got back on thursday evening i literally just slept i was like stressed guys i literally have a story time i know you guys saw by the title it's like luggage what 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 yes my luggage got lost you know so i have a story time to tell you guys that's how i was stressed i couldn't film yesterday you know and yeah that was that you know um so i'll tell you guys that story time right now i'm just on my way to um spa safe more actually to go buy bread and coffee and you know those few essentials and then i'll be filming that just to have context of the video and then i'll tell you guys the story time even if it's not today i'll tell you guys the story time before i close off this vlog because i was editing yesterday and i saw that this vlog is gonna be so short so i was like no i'm gonna film throughout this week so this weekend of the 25th we are not gonna have a vlog like I know you guys are gonna see this next week but this weekend just know that because of this i didn't upload this vlog you know but yeah <laughs> i'm back home i feel so content <sighs> but anyways let's go let's go let's go let's go let's go you're a freak and a friend too yeah you into everything i'm into oh i got something that i can lend you oh a piece of mind baby come and get a piece of mind Say you gotta work from three to nine. Oh, I get you home by a decent time. Wait, your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's the feeling that I get when we lock lips. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I f your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring. So, hi there, guys. Um, it's a little later onwards, and now we're actually like having a small price something. Um, so I'm gonna show you guys that you know I was just trying to take as much content. I even decided today I'm basically gonna, I'm basically gonna go to town, but then later it just didn't work up because the rain was raining, guys. The rain was flushing down the drains, like literally no cap, you know. It was raining rivers. It was about to be a hole. I don't know. They were trying to form a whole dam here or something like that. Yeah. So I am actually preparing. Um, like I'm washing the pan so that I can like spice the things there, like the wash and the steak steak chops like to spice everything there and then we start brining but it's kind of like drizzling so i don't know if the rain is against us someone sent it for us if someone is doing the work but we can't complain for things that we paid for remember so yeah that's basically what we're doing i feel like i'm gonna close this vlog up tomorrow i mean today and i'm gonna post this vlog tomorrow on a sunday so actually we're just gonna have a vlog because i just want to close this vlog off you know i want to finish editing close the vlog up here and start a new fresh and start a new fresh vlog next week i don't know what this is and I look so tired because I recently just woke up like five, six, seven minutes ago. Somewhere there, you know, I was like woken up. I was like told, you no, know, you need to like spice the meat and this and that and that. So I'm quite tired. And the sun, I don't know if it's the sun or if it's the water that's doing this to my face. But they had good work. They are at good work. They are challenging me at this point, you know. So yeah, let's do that. Let me show you guys that. And talk to you guys later. Shut up.
touch that fire for you I do that three, four times again I testify for you I told I like you, that bitch I do it All that I'm around, you scared to do I'm not, as long as you joking Now it for me, I ain't got it I've been skimming, looting Hide your body As long as you dreaming about me Ain't no problem I don't got nobody just with you right now But the truth, I look better under you I can lose when I'm with you How can us lose and miss the moment? You just too important Nobody, nobody like you do I can lose when I'm with you I can just lose and miss the moment You just too important Nobody, nobody like you do So guys morning actually it's, it's not even morning i think it's afternoon it's like 12 something so i had breakfast um i had breakfast i just finished cleaning now i look so dusty like can you see my hair like all the dust is literally here i look so dusty so now i look dusty crusty musty fasty lusty nasty sasty everything else in between so now i'm actually gonna take a, a shower i'm preparing lunch now um i took did i take the meat out whoa i think i took it out oh i took it out and then i put it back into the fridge because we're gonna have like steak chops again today um and then i'm putting rice on the stove we're like gonna fry outside you know we're gonna like have a grill fry station outside and then we'll see what i'll do for bagels 
I'll decide later after bathing. But I just want to bath and feel fresh, guys. The way I'm feeling right now, jealous of the time, you know, because I didn't bath in the morning. And like last night when I slept, I just took a very quick shower. So yeah, talk to you guys once I'm done bathing. Um, so guys, you want to understand how glad I am that my mom bought this, like it's already sliced. So I'm so happy that she bought this. Because imagine like chopping up a whole pumpkin, like the skin, everything. That's so much anxiety for me. That's so much work for me, you know. So I'm so glad that she bought this, that it's already sliced. So I'm just gonna... The stove is so slow. I don't know why the stove is so slow, but... You know. So I'm basically just gonna throw this in. And yeah. Guys, so I'm gonna tell you guys about my luggage. So as you all know, I drove back from Benzook last week. Last week, Thursday, I came back. Thursday evening, you know. So the initial plan was for me to come Friday early morning eh? because on Thursday it got so so super late that I was like, no, I don't wanna drive at night. The the biggest and the first reason was because I wanted to film content, you know, on the road and I wanted to do this and that and that. But the mere fact that you know I was like um I just felt to myself, no, it got it, it had gotten late, and also felt to myself, okay, fine, cool. At least I'll be able to rest out, you know, because I was writing exams on that same Thursday. So I was like, okay, fine, cool, shop. I'll only be driving on Friday, you know. And I was prepared, you know. I I I, I took out my clothes that I was driving with. I was comfortable, this and that. Next minute, and the thing was that it was raining. It was raining the cattiest, cattiest, and the doggiest, doggiest cats and dogs, you know. So it was like a no, no for me. Thunder, lightning was there. Paraka, paraka, pa, you know. The aunties and the grannies were busy. I love us Biesak. I love us Biesak, my aunt, you know. So, um, I had gotten comfortable in around like 7, 8 p.m. You know, I was called, you know, by a driver. He was like, nah, I still, uh, you know, I'm done and I'm standing here. I'm, I'm ready to come get you. What, what, and this and that. For a brief moment, I just felt to myself like, because like, because I was like, I want to sleep under my parents' roof that day that thursday you know and then i i was also like um it was just like you know everyone was going back and you know that it was just that all around you know so the fact the mere fact that i was still there it was like you know so i had came i i drove with the guy and the thing is that when the guy uh, when the guy arrived at imona i knew the guy you know when i saw him i'm like oh, yeah i know him you know because over the phone i wasn't told his name i wasn't told anything i was just told this is a driver you know because i was like i connected one of a trustworthy driver that i always travel with and he was like, I found you a driver, this is a driver, he's really trustworthy, this and that and that. And then when I got the guy, when I, I mean, when the guy got there, I was like, I know this guy very well, you know. I was like, I know this guy very well. And then, you know, he knows me, I know him. Just, you know, because we are from, we are from the same town, we're both from Ocho, so he's also from Ocho, but he like resides here, you know. So he knows me, I know him, like, not no, 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 but then like, you know, we see each other and I know like, okay, he's, who's, who's, who's done and he's like, okay, who's, who's, you know, sort of vibes, you know. Fine, who's sharp, um... We drive, we get to Okanja, from Okanja, and you know, mind you, like, the whole way, it's, like, literally raining, like, it is raining, raining, you know, so we get to Ochurango, um, I had said, I, I wrote down in my notes, I just forgot, but we got into Ochurango around 11, 11, I'm sure it was before 11.20, that I'm sure, because it was 11 something something, it was before 11.20, you know, we got in, and then the first stop, um, was, um, we we're dropping off someone that stayed in town, fine cool shop. We dropped that person off because we are one, two, three, four. We are four. We dropped that person off at town and then we dropped the second person off at um, another place at his destination. And then now, um, because all those people in town, like I have to come back to the, loca to, to the um, location most. Fine cool shop. We dropped those two guys off and the other, th and the other third guy um, was, you know, still, you know, I don't know what he was probably planning on how to, you know, where to meet the people because apparently he wasn't from the town and, you know, this and that. So we had to sort out where he'd be got it where he had to get off and i was no i was like no i have, I still have to go with your money at the atm like to pay you and then we had got into i don't know what's it it was shell service we got there fine cool shop i get the money i pay the guy after that i'm like no i want to go get myself a snack because mind you the whole way that i drove by and then afterwards i'm like going to get myself snacks and then i'm like you know because i hadn't eaten the whole way i was just like i just don't want i, I just want to get home like i don't want to delete anything i'm um, going to shop stop here yeah, this and that so it's just like i'm just gonna you know in plus i had e i had already eaten you know i already ate because i was like comfortable you know i was like i'm staying so I, the only thing i was literally drinking was only water i was literally only drinking water you know 
um i bought those snacks after that i loaded those snacks on the car and then afterwards i was like but luckily i had my phone and my handbag with me you know because i was like going i was paying everything the cash was in my handbag and i was like holding my phone okay fine cool shop and then i'll go to the restroom i go to the restroom i i go to the restroom and then i come out i don't see a car so you know i'm just thinking to myself okay fine cool shop maybe the person is parked somewhere because he was like parked um where he's like filling up his his petrol and then now i can't see him there because i know he can't stand there for quite a minute you know so i'm just thinking to myself okay fine he, he parked somewhere cool shop i'm looking around you know because it's this car i'm looking around for the color of the car i can't see it okay i see some several cars i approach them it's not they, it's not it's not him actually you know so i'm like trying to i don't even have eight time there so i'm like trying to like reach out to my mom so that my mom can like call the guy and you know and try figure out where he is but then i'm not panicking because i'm like i know the guy the guy knows me so there's no way that he's gonna drive off with my luggage or anything else you know and plus he stays here so literally he, there is no way he can go sort of vibes you know so cool shop my mom calls the guy you know the guy's phone is just ringing 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 ring. the guy doesn't answer you know she tries again 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 she tries and then the minute that the guy doesn't even he doesn't answer because the whole way literally when we were driving every time he was being called by someone he was answering so i'm also thinking to myself okay fine cool shop why is the person not answering like what's going on like what happened you know and i'm just like a little bit panic is like kicking in but then the thing that's still holding me back is the fact that i know him so even if he has to run off with my luggage i still know him like i know him you know um and the, and the biggest worry is not about him running off with the luggage the biggest worry is the fact that he is with someone and, the, and that person like he might not be paying attention and that person might just like you know open the boot and take several of my stuff because you know there was my laptop bag was there laptop everything was there you know there were my chargers my adapters you know those electronic things because of the clothes i wouldn't okay i would worry so much about it but i feel like you know he just didn't pay attention because even when we were dropping off the first two guys he was literally seated in front he just opened the boot and the guy was thinking of things i'm like you're supposed to stand there and make sure that the person takes out their right stuff you know so i literally get off the cab and I'm just standing there behind, you know, checking that guy like, Putty, Max Seeker, you just take your things, you know. I'm just like, Max Seeker, they just take your things, you know. I'm just standing there, you know. The guy doesn't do anything. Fine, cool shop. My parents are like, where are you? I'm still like, I'm, I'm still here at the service station, you know. And it's like a little bit ghetto. It's wild, you know. There are just like people there. Like, security guards are not even worrying. The security guards are literally standing and speaking with these people that are looking, you know. And I guess was most fun. Went to Exmos, no, basically, you know. So I'm just like walk i'm like walk i'm hiding my phone and i'm making sure that by all means i'm standing close to the entrance of the of the of the of the of the fuel shopping or whatever you call it you know that fuel shop whatever i'm just standing by the entrance of that so if anything happens i you know i just run in or do something you know because because literally ghetto people are standing next to me asking me money talking to me passing me by checking me you know so i'm like mm, please note i guess i'm going to i guess i'm going to dar dollar i'm kidding guys but yeah so my parents ask me uh, my parents just tell me like just stay there we're coming to get you they come get me you know and that's like an hour pass you know the guy's not responding i come back home i'm literally tired but that tide was even like over 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 overshadowed like it was overshadowed by the fact that my luggage you know everything literally everything and the biggest thing is that the thing that i kept thinking myself is that I took my phone because i was like rushing to go to the restroom because even when we stopped at okancha i didn't go so the whole way i was literally sitting like whole three hours we were driving i was literally seated sitting and i'm just drinking water you know so i really wanted to go to the toilet so i was just like i must leave my phone inside the car but also i was like there was just something telling me just take your bag and your phone along you know sort of vibes you know fine cool shop um we get home we still call the guy the guy you know and then i tell my parents which who the guy is and my parents are like no it's fine um we know the guy you know you um there's nothing that you can do but the biggest worry is that he's with someone and that person you know he's not paying attention when the person takes off luggage that person can easily take my laptop like that person can easily do anything you know so we try and reach out to people that we know that knows him and they also try i mean they are they also try calling the guy the guy is not answering this and that you know and i just mind you this is like past midnight already this is like friday midnight hours now and i'm still awake like i'm still woke you know um so i just decide you know i'm just gonna sleep i'm literally in my jeans i don't have anything to wear i literally slept that day in my jeans in my jeans i literally slept that day in my jeans and luckily i was wearing that uh, um vest on top of that striped shirt that i was wearing so i literally slept in that you know and i was it was so uncomfortable like i swear to god it was so uncomfortable you know um morning comes the guy is calling around 5 5 a.m he's literally calling me you know non-stop this and that and that to so answer and then it's apparently like um oh, no he had to attend an emergency this and that but where my man home he asked me to direct him to our flat and then he gets here my parents are literally like fuming not even my parents like my mom was like okay fine cool shop just a little bit you know civilized but my dad was literally fuming that i was like you know there's no em emergency that you can say that you could just you know disappear for the whole night 
disappear without letting me know. Imagine I'm just in the restroom. I'm not even doing anything. I haven't gone to spa. I haven't gone to where where you can say, oh, you are spa water. I'm literally across the car like this in a restroom where you can say, peep, what, what, or you can literally get in and go call me, you know? So that's, you know, and then I also started filming up. I'm also like, what emergency was he explains the emergency? Okay, fine, it's personal. But for me, that was, the, the emergency that he explained was so ridiculous. I was like, I was like, And the, and the mere fact that that emergency had to be attended here in the location. So you are literally coming to the location. Like, he literally came to the location to attend to that emergency. So, I'm in the restroom. I mean, I was in the restroom. I just waited for 10 seconds. So, I, I mean, I'm halfway done or I'm almost done. Or I'm like 10% away from being done, you know. So, the relations got in me, come to the location, drop me off and pass the emergency, you know. Like, I, I, I didn't even sleep that night properly. Like, I didn't sleep properly. I didn't literally didn't sleep properly, you know. So, I, the mo the main thing that I was like, you know, I was just like, what if the, my, what if my bag is taken? What if the left is taken? What if this is taken? What if that is taken? What if, what my, and the thing is that I was like, I was like, peaked. I was like, what, what could it be? Like, what could it be that it just disappeared like that? What could it be that he does not answer the phone? For the emergency that that guy stated, let me tell you, let me tell you this for free. For the emergency that that, that, that guy stated, I was like, you couldn't even answer your phone. That was, guys, I just want to tell you, you know, what the emergency was, me. I want to tell you that, me. But it's sort of like personal. And you know, we, I, I mean, like, okay, it's fine. It's fine, sort of personal, me. It's like, okay, not even sort of personal, but it's personal. But also, the, for the fact that he stated that emergency in a situation that I was in was so, so, so ridiculous. Like, till today, I'm asking, you know, that this time I'm filming up, I'm like, you should film up because I'm asking myself, like, You couldn't answer your phone, you come to the location, you're not even, you're not even bringing me along, you don't even... Yo! 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 But yeah. Yeah. So I was literally like, I lost my luggage, I lost my laptop, I lost this and that and that, that, this, that, that. And I was so thankful that I just had my handbag and my handbag had all my wallets, I mean my, uh, my, all my cards and you know. I also had my phone luckily, you know, in my hands and you know, yeah. So I got everything back. I got everything back, you know, um, everything in one piece. You know, the first thing that when I got back, I checked if my laptop is there. I saw my laptop is there. And then I checked for other, you know, my adapters, my chargers, my things, that's and that, that. And then everything was there. Okay, fine, cool. So yeah, basically that was that. That was just a story time. I'm seeing it's 13 minutes now. Wow. A story time. What a story time. But yeah, guys, that was basically just what occurred that day about the luggages. Um, and I'm... I'm I'm okay now. I'm okay now. Got my luggage and just out here flexing. I'm so glad that I filmed this video today, guys. Like I am so. Excuse me. I'm so super glad. I'm so super content. You know. So yeah, that was basically just the story time. So we have reached the end of this video. If you like this video, if you've watched till this point, you definitely can't tell me that you're watching without subscribing. If you definitely can't tell me you can't. You haven't commented like up to this point. Like there wasn't any interesting moment that you found like you know that appealed to your mind, to your soul, to your everything that you decided that you're not gonna comment can that under and can comment it's for free it doesn't cost you anything like anything let me keep this thing brief let me keep this thing brief it's for free you know so please go comment down below like subscribe and share guys you know one thing about um one thing about the thing that you guys do um dear dazzlers is that uh, um in as much as you guys comment in as much as you guys like my videos in as much as you guys subscribe i swear to god the things that make me the most happiest content the things that make me like i can definitely that reassures me is when you always share you know when you always share my videos you know because it plays a very big part of a role you know because i remember my other video that reached 700 and something views which what did i title the video or oh, the one that i came back with um the i lost everything that's in that video that video was shared and i literally the views that i got that on that video in the days like literally i was standing at 600 in two days you know that i have never gotten even in my uni vlog i was standing on 300 views in two days that uni vlog only surfaced surpassed um you know as time went you know so if you share my videos it plays a really really major 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 role so please do share my videos and please don't skip my videos please because i'm reaching almost to be monetized right now i don't know there are like two types of monetization like there's one for 500 subscribers and one for 1k subscribers 
so i'm on a journey for that and i need all the watch hours that i can possibly get so please don't skip my videos please i beg you but definitely share definitely comment definitely like let us beat this youtube algorithm as namabians let us be recognized let us youtubers be recognized let put the dazzle the dazzler's names on top for sangela okay nah, then so we've come to the end of this video um thank you guys so much for watching to this point please don't forget to like comment subscribe and share and um tell a friend to tell a friend tell a friend to tell a friend and yeah see you guys in my next video and there's gonna be so 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 much vlogging and so so much content like this is only the start like there is no need to be fun so see you guys in my next video don't forget to dazzle and remember always rise beyond to shine check out my other socials and ciao dazzle nasha singela ladder ladder gesien Control, control, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, you say you want to take control, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it, see they do me a bad, bad, control.